Most people know who Country Wayne is because he recently had a number one special on Netflix and he's also been performing comedic skits for years. But what most people don't know is that Country Wayne found his start as a Facebook creator with Facebook monetization tools and specifically in stream ads years ago. And he's been able to do it without a large production company, only using his cell phone and coming up with creative strategies to upload several times a day. And in this video, we're going to break those strategies down so you can easily implement them and start finding success with Facebook monetization in 2024. So what I did, I took the TV format, people talking about residual TV shows, and I minimized it. I got my version of that. Okay. And now I'm able to make residuals. I'm making money right now while I'm sitting. One of the first things Country Wayne understood about Facebook monetization is that you're able to make money while you're sleeping once you upload the content. And this is what attracts most smart content creators because YouTube is the same way. You upload a video, it gets views forever. You make money off of that video forever so the more videos you have that people are finding and people are searching for the more passive income you're creating country wayne called it residuals and that's the attractive aspect of becoming a full-time content creator because the content creates income for you while you sleep because you're partaking in the ads business of the platform and country wayne understood this from the very beginning of his facebook monetization journey you big on facebook and and youtube yeah. So where, where, where do you where do you release most of your content on both? I made a post today and asked everyone, what would you like to learn about social media? And one of the questions was, how do I monetize all platforms? And Country Wayne just told us exactly how you do that. When you create a piece of content, that piece of content should automatically be redistributed to all other platforms so that you can monetize those platforms as well. It's the one to many model and it's what makes being a content creator so attractive because if you can tap into it, then you can tap into true income and start building true wealth. And not only that, but now you can take those different videos and you can even mix and match them to make new pieces of content. There are just so many different creative things you can do once you have the library of content, because once you have the library of content, you have leverage. You know, the social media game, you know, it's in-stream ads and stuff, but they didn't have that at first. So right here we see that Country Wayne tells us that it was in-stream ads. In stream ads, this man went from Facebook in stream ads to the number one special on Netflix. You have the same monetization tools as Country Wayne. You have the same ability to earn what he earned. The only difference is the skill level. A lot of times when people complain about pay rates and Facebook in stream ads, if I go and look at their content, I'm going to find repurposed content that they did not create. And there's nothing wrong with that as long as you're adding significant edits, remixing, editing to the videos. Facebook is cool with it. But I want to challenge you to become creative and to become a true creator and start making something and posting that instead of being shy or looking for an easy way or trying to do some automation where people don't want to get on video and they want to make lazy, cheap content that gets money, which is all the hype and rave right now. You can earn this same type of income if you're able to craft a personality or a piece of content style that people are willing to engage with on Facebook. So if you hear people talking about how Facebook in stream ads doesn't pay that much or anything like that, don't let that stop you from participating in the program to the fullest of your personal capability because you do not know what they're posting. You do not know their personal situation and it just may be they aren't creating the best content. Once I seen that money in those kids, I was coming up with these scenarios I got in my head. You do this, you do this, you do this. Bam. We don't edit. We record it. Cut off the action. I don't edit nothing. I use my cell phone. So a lot of times we see these skits and we think that, oh, there's this big production. They're storyboarding. They're scripting their videos. And a lot of YouTubers do those things. But Country Wayne was just pulling out his cell phone and still is. And they're just saying, hey, you do this. You do that. They're doing basic improv, doing comedic skits, keeping people's attention, and then just uploading the video to Facebook, not doing any editing at all so maybe you've been thinking i can't find success in in-stream ads because i don't have a high quality camera or i don't have a 500 dollars lens or maybe you've been thinking i don't have a good microphone and so i don't sound good or maybe you've been thinking i need a new macbook or maybe your excuse is i need to storyboard my videos or maybe your excuse is i don't know how to come up with good stories or skits or ideas whatever the situation is you have the same tool as country wayne and you can pull it off 
it's even easier for you to pull this off if you want to today because you have artificial intelligence and you can totally tell ChatGPT to create a skit for you based around something that's similar to your interests that your followers like. Now you may be thinking, I don't have friends, so how can I pull this off? Coming to America is probably one of the most classic movies that Eddie Murphy has ever done and I don't think he can ever top the original movie. If you guys like the sequel, let me know in the comments. I think it tarnished the original. In that movie, Eddie Murphy played several different characters, as did Arsenio Hall. And that's something that he has been known for as taking up several roles in his own films and there's no reason why if you wanted to start doing your own skits like country wayne you couldn't say hey you know what i'm gonna play all of the roles i'll admit you have to be a little bit creative to pull it off but it's something that you could do and i just want you to see the possibilities of what you can do with in-stream ads if you're willing to go beyond what the people around you are probably doing and complaining about because they're not finding success with it and making your own path if you want to see the full interview i'm going to put a link to it right here at the end of this video and that's all i'm going to put right here because you absolutely need to go over to club shay shay and soak up all of the game he dropped about facebook monetization and social media monetization in that video because it's 35 minutes of nothing but game that you need to learn and that you need to hear about how he found success with facebook monetization and i'll see you guys in another video on another day go check that video out